That boy. Oh, there's his papa. Father. Lancer, my son. Have you dispatched the Lightners as I commanded? N no, but I did even better. Turns out we don't actually have to fight them. They said they could just talk to you, and... They're alive? Yes, and I think you'll like them a lot. They're Susie, she's very purple and strong, and... Where are they now? Um... Here they are. Hey. It's nice to meet you. Lancer? Lancer, my son. Yes, father? Do you remember what I told you? Don't get too attached. You have failed. They have poisoned you with their sentimentality. Free yourself, Lancer. They care not for you. Their only goal is to destroy our glorious fountain. They are scum. No, they aren't. What did you say? Let him go. <laughs> you want me to let him go? And how about this? I'll drop him off the edge and let him splatter. Unless you all kneel and learn your place. What will it be, Lightners? Don't listen to him, Susie. He'll... He'll... Now watch, Lancer. See what happens when you befriend Lightners. Oh, dang, he stabbed him in the back. Literally. You, you traitor, come back here. Alright, enough already. Who the hell do you think you are? <laughs> to my people, I am a hero. To you? Ew, he's gross. I'm the bad guy. King blocked the way. Um, let's check. Magic. Alright, you defend and defend. Let's get that TP up. Abandoned by the Lightners, his heart became cracked with hatred. Ah. He cannot be reasoned with, but don't give up. How dare you come here, Lightners? King's mouth gave a berserk smile. Um. Um. Let's, uh. Talk to him with Ralsei. And. You defend. Ralsei tried to reason with the king. You might not realize it, but this is a world where you don't have to fight. I know if we try, we can all find another way. Such simple-minded platitudes. A shame you will not live to realize your naivety. Now perish with the pathetic lightners you worship. Sorry, my friends aren't going anywhere. Ozzy's will is changing. Talk became dual heal. Oh. You that left us in the shadows, stripped of meaning. Oh dang, he's trying to attack all three of us. Oh. Oh. Um. That was interesting. Okay. Um, dual heal. Oh man, 50% TP. Yikes. Let's talk with Susie. And you defend. Susie tried to reason with the king. Alright, listen up. Lancer's my friend. So if we can get by without hurting you, then if I perish, so be it. Show my son the monster you really are. Alright, you want to see what I can do, huh? Susie's will is changed. Talk became Red Buster. Okay. You dare return to torment us once again? Okay. Um. What if I try to talk to him? TP's max. Try to reason with the king. Silence, Lightbringer. Your very existence goes against your own. By the knight's will, I shall shatter your heart to pieces. Talk became courage. Oh no. Be gone. We have found fre fresh purpose. Oh, 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 oh. Let's go, Pong. Darkness pours from the fountain. Okay. Um. Defense boost by 25%. Um. Okay. You encourage the party. The party's defense raised for this turn. Oh, good, because we're all getting attacked. Oh, the moving is so erratic. Okay. Um. Um. 
red damage. Um, I don't want to fight though. Like we're not supposed to fight, right? Um, I just keep encouraging. You encourage the party. The knight that pulls the fountains from the earth. Oh, it's red now. Oh, 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 oh. Oof. Um. We're gonna have to dual heal. Um. Rude damage. Red damage and rude damage. Soul shine its power on Rossi. All right. We're all healed up. Holy fountains whose shadows are creating a new world. Our world. Oof. Oh, no. Darkness pours from the fountain. Okay. Um. Courage? We'll just defend. And... I mean, we're not doing anything to him. Um. Do you see now our new purpose? Do I just have to, like, get him to go through all his dialogue? Is that what's going on here? I remember that was a thing, too, in Undertale. Like, you just have to go through all the dialogue. Red damage. Uh, am I supposed to do red damage? Uh... What does red damage even mean? Your soul shine is power on Susie. 278. Hmm. Soon as well shall be blanketed in darkness, and darkness shall rule it. Okay. I don't think... Oh, we got a different attack, though. Um, yeah, I don't think doing damage is the way. Courage. Defend. Defend. Raise that TP again. live in despair. Oh, no. Um. Alright, we got this attack again. Oof. Okay. Um. The battlefield is rumbling. That's different. Okay, let's heal everyone. Defend. Got it. Now, enough talk. Fall before the chain of justice. Fall this thing down. Oh no! Oh! Oh! Dang, that did a lot of damage. Can I do a heal? Oh, it needs. I'm at 49% and needs 50. Yikes. Okay. I just hope he does a different attack that I can dodge easily. Oh, you're quite strong, aren't you? I keep working myself, like, into corners with that. Um. We need, we need, we need a Healy. Okay. Um. If I keep fighting it like this, then. Okay, yeah, yeah, we're getting somewhere, we're getting somewhere, we're getting somewhere. Oh, that's doing so much damage. Oh, it's so erratic. Oof. Battlefield is rumbling. Um. Uh, courage. Can I use an item on Chris? Or does Chris have to use the item on Chris? Uh, we have to heal Chris. She's a, she's a dark candy. Um, defend and defend. It seems that. Oh, oh, dang. Um, let's heal so that way we're as close to max as we can be right now. 
my knight. I shall not fail you. Huh. Okay. I thought we were getting somewhere, but... Oh, there we go. Enough is enough. I see. I see that I cannot defeat you. I have grown exhausted from our long battle. Oh. Lightners, I... Perhaps I have been too cruel. The truth is, I was not always this way. There once was a time where darkners and lightners lived in harmony. A time where darkners could fulfill their purpose in peace. It would be a, a, a lie to say that I, too, do not yearn for those days. Perhaps... Perhaps you young ones are right. Please, let us put away our weapons. There must be a peaceful solution to all this. He's faking us. He's faking us. Come now, Susie. He's faking us. He's faking us. Don't trust him. I'm glad you're starting to realize, Mr. King. None of us really want to fight. Why is there like a black pixel being where Susie was? <laughs> you can just tell us about your worries. I'm sure we can all be friends, Mr. King. Yes, friends. That sounds lovely. Cough. My apologies. I am I am not used to fighting like that. My body is getting weak. Oh, don't say another word. Don't heal him. There. You should be all healed up. How do you feel? Well, let's see. <laughs> I knew it. He's faking us. Never better. Y you... Did I say you could get up? Ooh. Chris? Dang. Oh, spare me the heroics. Oh, you be way back there. We're gonna have to fight alone? Is that what's going on here? Is Lancer gonna come in for the save? You. You're the leader, aren't you? So, what's your plan? To laugh as you cast us all back into obscurity? You can't even say. Young one, let me tell you a secret. Quiet people piss me off. Oh, dang. Hey, get away from my friend. Hey, 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 hey. Or what? You'll kill me? Nah. So what's your plan, then? To talk me to death? You stupid, stupid lightner. Do you honestly think you have any way to convince me not to kill you? Nah, but they might. Oh, all the boys. Lancer? Everyone? What is the meaning of this? Sorry, Dad, but you're being overthrown. When I told everyone you were fighting the Lightners, everyone remembered how kind they were. They decided they'd rather have a king that accepts them. Me. Now I'm the dad. You idiots, the Lightners are your enemies. Fools, I'll kill you, I'll kill all of you. Yikes, I think someone needs a timeout. Go to your room, Dad. No. <laughs> Y'all right, Chris? Chris, Susie. Oh, you're all right. Yeah, it'll take more than that to take us down. Chris, Susie, I'm I'm sorry because I healed the king. We almost. Susie, you were right. I I was foolish to think we could act so soft on everyone. This isn't a world where kindness always wins, is it? And it's complicated. Yeah, sometimes there's people you just gotta fight. But if you never let your guard down, then you might just hurt someone you care about. Aw, oh, Susie, you're beginning to sound like a real hero. Eh, don't get used to it. Then, I... I suppose you and Chris should return home now. Yeah, I... I guess that's right, huh? That one black pixel on that rooftop. Well, uh, see ya. Later. We didn't even steal off the fountain. Okay, well, off we go. Hey, Chris, w wait a second. Um, I, look, I know you want to give a real goodbye to everyone, right? I mean, I'm all for leaving right away, but, you know, we could go back a sec if you wanted. Sure. Well, then what are we waiting for? Let's head back. Okay. Chris, Susie, you came back? Um, well, Chris just wanted to say bye, you know? Oh, actually, everyone here wanted to say goodbye, too. Please let me know when you leave, all right? Yeah, yeah, we'll try not to skip you. Way to go, kids. Now I can go back to making the puzzles we love. And thanks to your donation, I could buy a new hat and some shaving cream. 
Best. You're the best. Honestly, we owe you. You're absolutely amazing. Great but work. Uh, even a little ball can say something like thank you. Thank you, I can go back to being a code hanger now. By the by, I asked Sham to come here, but there wasn't any interest. Darn, horsey. You've done us a big help. Now all of us pieces can live in pieces. You did it. You ousted that rotten tyrant. I'll happily accept a bounty of credit for my contributions. <laughs> Unless the king reappears, in which case, I did nothing. Wonderful work, mine amigos. Thou hast toppled the tyrant, freed the creeds. Truly, hath history shall not forget the tale of rules card and the three heroes. Are we just going to go through everybody? I knew you could do it. Though I was your enemy, I was cheering for you. That's how much I dislike my job. The future looks sweet, like a pile of bees puke, which is honey, I think. A kingdom with so much hope. I hope you didn't screw it up. That means thank you. Come to our next birthday, too. We'll have one soon, if that's possible. Hathi looked at you proudly. Kiss. What's going on? I slept through everything. <laughs> oh, here's everyone. What ho, what about us? Aren't we going to be restored as kings? Uh, my treasure is unharmed? Carry on, then. Uh. Oops, I accidentally tabbed out. <laughs> um. That's animals decided it's okay if the kings stay in the cages as well. But they'll have to put on animal ears and noses. Mama me, but what a celebration. Everyone is here. This must be the birthday party I made that cake for. Clover's birth. Such a sweet occasion. I might cry. Uh, actually, this whole thing is, like, our fault. Oh, Mon Amiga, then you're Clover's mother? Now I understand why you ate the cake to protect her. Huh? Wait, no, I... Wait, if I go along with this, can I get more cake? Yo, answer, what's up? Susie, blue person whose name I neglected to learn all along. I thought you were going home ways. We were, but Chris wanted to say bye, you know? Oh, really? Ho ho ho, that's funny. I thought you wanted to say bye because we're friends. Huh? I mean, I did not want to. Um, so, you're the king now, huh? Yes, and I'm changing some big rules. First, lightners are now legal. Second, prison is now only for dads. Sounds like some pretty good changes. Hey, your dad was, uh, protecting the fountain, right? Is it gonna be okay if we mess with it? I have no idea. But it's you guys, so I trust you. If something bad happens, we'll fix it out. Yeah, I guess we'll just see what happens. Um, well, see you later. Come back soon. There's always room in town for a couple of clowns. I'll be honest, at first we weren't sure who who make our new king. I mean, Lancer has always been a bit of a pain. But after seeing how nice he treats you guys, I think he'll be fine. Because you rescued it. It grew to respect you. Well, actually, maybe it shrunk to respect you. Can we go through? Okay, that's as far as we can go. So now we gotta go back and talk to Ralsei again. He said not to skip him. So. Here we go. Chris, Susie, are you leaving? Hell if I know, I'm just following Chris. Guess we'll just walk to the right if we are. Yeah? Is that it? Yeah, okay. Alright. Susie, Chris, are you going to leave? Uh-oh. Um, I, I just wanted to say, I... I... I really enjoyed meeting you two, and... Hey, can you stop mumbling into your hat for a sec? I can barely hear you, dude. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh. Um, Chris? Susie? I... <laughs> I hope I can see you again soon. Next time I'll make you lots of yummy cakes, alright? Um, yeah. Sure, dude. <laughs> He's a goat person. Let's go, Chris. So these are like monsters that got left down in the underground when they all came to the surface? Is that what's going on here? What a cool looking portal. I like the pixel art here. The like shadows. Is this the fountain? Don't know how, but... It feels like we stumbled into something really important, didn't we? 
I hate reading slow scrolling text like that. <laughs> well, there's no time to think about that now. Think about that now. Right now. It's time to go home. Right, Chris? As you stood in front of the fountain, you felt something strange. It was as if your very soul was glowing. Guitar's going. Oh, man. Uh, what happened? I can't see anything. Are you back in that closet? Hey, watch it. Yep, we're in that closet. Huh? The unused classroom. How did we get here? Hey, Chris. What? What just happened? Like, that wasn't a dream or anything, was it? I don't know. We do have cards and checkers and chess and everything there. Anyway, as I was saying, let's just tell Alfie's we couldn't find any chalk. All right. Man, the sun's already setting. Everyone else must have gone home by now. This Alfie's a little better than to ask us next time, huh? Uh, well, guess we should go. See you later, I guess. Chris? Let's go back there tomorrow, all right? Okay. Where's our classroom? It was this way, right? Yep. There's flowers. There's a bunch of roses. The computer's turned off. Everything felt peaceful for a moment. Okay. Well, off we go. Ring, ring. Chris? Whatever have you been doing? I sat in the car waiting for you after school for half an hour. I called and called, but you never picked up. You had your poor mother worried sick. Chris, I'm afraid I'm going to have to punish you. Huh? A friend? You're spending time with a friend? Chris, I will make an exception this time. You can continue your adventures a little longer. But when you return home, you're going to have to go to bed early. See you soon, honey. Okay. Why, Brarby? Um, hospital? Police? Oh, dang, a police line. Hey, punk, get out of the road. You're blocking traffic. Oh, wait, it's just Asgore's kid. Sorry, I'm a little, uh, worked up lately. This job is so boring. Nothing ever happens in this town. I just wish something would shake things up. Huh? You got something to report? The Dark World. What? There's a Dark World inside the school? Uh, sure, kid. There's no law against Dark Worlds anyway. That's a job for the school board. <laughs> okay. What was the way home? QC's Diner, Ice E's Pizza. I don't know if this is the end, and I know we're way over time, but, uh, if this is the end, I don't want to end the episode and then just come back for, like, five minutes. Oh, here we go. Welcome home, honey. Did you have fun with your friend today? By the way, I just finished baking a pie. If you go to bed, it'll be cool when you wake. But do not eat it all this time, alright? Uh, I'm just gonna record. So this will probably be, like, part two. Last episode probably won't have an outro. So butterscotch cinnamon pie. It's still cooling. It's my room. Should I just go to bed? If you go to bed, this chapter of your adventures will end. Will you go to bed? Yeah. This is chapter one anyway, right? Like, that's it. Just it. It's over. You decided to go to bed. And that's it? Are there going to be credits? Oh. There's me. Uh... 
Um. Oh, I can move. No. Um. Oh. Uh. Um. Oh. Uh. That's not good. This is just creepy. I just caged up my heart. Um. Okay. A knife. Oh no. Yikes. Well, what's that? Delta. Ooh, made a voice save. Um when the light is burning low and the shadows start oh. to grow. And the places that you know seem like we got lyrics. Um, is that Laura Shigihara singing? Inside your soul she she was uh, she famous. Oh yeah, there, there it is, Laura Shigihara. From she was uh she's known for being in like To the Moon, and uh, Finding Paradise. Don't forget. She sang like the songs in those games. To be continued in chapter two. We done did it. Uh. Well, apparently the game closes itself when it's done, because of course it does, because Toby Fox. Um, <laughs> so it cut me off. Um, I was hoping it would kick me back to the menu, but of course it doesn't. Um, but yeah, that's Delta Rune. Um, yeah, this is the Legend of Delta Rune. There you go. Um, I'm not gonna read this because I already read this way back. Um, yeah, that's Delta Rune. Uh, your daily discourse for today. Let me know what you thought of this game, whether you've played it or whether you've just watched this. Um, yeah, let me know what you thought of it. Let me know in the comments down below. So that's gonna do it for us for today. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you all next time. Bye bye.